Gotta show you guys the sunrise this morning. There we go. It's so windy. <sighs> the airplane's a paid actor. Getting ready for a spin class this morning. The sun coming in right now has me looking like pink or red or something. <laughs> so bright. But I'm wearing this set active set to, what do I have? Fuzz on my, on my biker shorts. I am going to a spin class with my friend Mackenzie this morning. Happy Friday, me with my socks in my hand. Happy casual Friday, of course. And then we have a really fun eventful day. Jay's family's coming here and we're gonna have ourselves a happy Friday and I figured I would just take this to the weekend. So, hi guys. And welcome to this vlog. I'm Sydney if you're new here. I'm about to head into my spin class. I spilled my entire pre-workout on the passenger seat. So I had to pull over and use my leather conditioner. And I was like, oh, while I'm at the gas station, I'll just get gas, because I need gas too. Didn't have my wallet. So that was good, but that's okay. Headed into my spin class, gonna have a good workout and I will see you guys after. Spin class complete. Woo woo. She's got her Uggs on. <laughs> Here's my outfit for today. We're going shopping. Well, actually we're going to Hyde Park with Jay's family. So they're shopping around there, but we're actually going to Bar Taco. So I'm just doing like a casual cute, it's casual Friday, of course. I'm wearing this, uh, this is actually kind of dressier for me, but this white top and it kind of has like a shoulder pad look. It's not shoulder pads, but kind of like a ruffle right here. And then my E. Goldie shorts. It's been a while since I've worn some jean shorts and then these black sandals. And my Prada Sunnies. We went to Bar Taco and it's so windy. I don't even know if you'll be able to hear us. What is it? We went to Bar Taco. When the dog hangs his head out the window. I know, that's how it feels. Like we've got our head out the window. It's so windy here right now, but we're at Armature Works. We went to Hyde Park for lunch. We went to Bar Taco. We walked around at some shops. We actually went into Nike, which I've never been to the Nike in Tampa, and found some really cute stuff. So I'll have to show you guys when we get home. And then now, yeah, we're just gonna sit out here. It's nice out, it's just so windy. So we're just hanging with Jay's mom and her brother. And we're having ourselves a little day. It feels like a Saturday, even though it's Friday, doesn't it? Also, we're like, are these people nuts putting their feet in the river? Who the heck knows what's in there? Yeah, if you're from Tampa, you know you cannot see in that water at all. I know. The bottom, so it's kind of a... Uh, Living life on the edge. Very much so. Look at this wind. This is I got these off of Amazon. I was just snacking on them. They are so good. If you like flavored, or if you like coconut flavor at least. I am obsessed with like anything coconut or pina colada and whatnot, and I love these. They're kind of like, instead of having chips or crackers, they're kind of like more of a sweet snack, and I love. I also figured I would show you guys my exact recipe that I did for my smoothie this past week because I think I perfected my smoothie, so let's go through it. Okay, 30 grams of hemp heart. And then I do a serving of the almond milk, which I do 240 milliliters. And then I do 140 grams of frozen blueberries. This is hard to record and watch at the same time. And then I've been doing it with the vegan chocolate protein, but if you don't like vegan protein, because it does have a different taste, like I actually really like the vegan protein as long as it's blended with something, but you could always do ISO. I, I don't typically do whey just because I don't think it digests well for me, but um, ISO has a bunch of different flavors. I think that chocolate tastes really good in like a fruit smoothie, but I think vanilla, that was my go-to for a while too, just to do like a plain standard vanilla. And I think that's it for this. Blend it on up. I think these proportions make it like a really good thick consistency for a smoothie. Yum.
Look at that color. Jay is headed to have dinner with some friends. I need to get behind here because the lighting's so bad. I wanted to show his Nike stuff before he left. Look at this fit. He already had the Air Forces, but new pants. You wanna do a little 360 maybe? Oh my gosh. Guys' outfits are honestly so much cooler than girls' outfits. It sucks. I could put a whole notebook in there. You really could. Pocketbook. Pocketbook. <laughs> My dad always calls um, wallets pocketbooks. Pocketbook. Is that why? Right there. <laughs> and then a new shirt, too. New shirt. Oversized I love look. it. Yeah. He did a 32 in the pants and then an extra large extra in the top for a little oversized action we'll have fun thank you baby Good morning guys, my Saturday morning YouTube grind where I catch up on some of my vloggers. This morning is my girl Caitlin. Here's my outfit for the gym today. Holy Moses, it's so bright. I'm wearing this Nike set that I got yesterday and it's this cute, let me get where it's not so dang bright. It's this cute like scoop neck Nike bra. Why have I forgotten about Nike clothes? Like I actually used to wear them all the time. Like back in college and whatnot, probably like early college, I would wear those, gosh, what are they called? They're like the running shorts with, they're like a little bit baggier, I guess. And they have like the built-in underwear, but I would wear those with like a big t-shirt all the time. And I don't think I've worn Nike clothes since. Got these shorts on with the built-in underwear as well. And then I'm also wearing some Nike sneakers. I haven't worn these in a while either. It's been a little bit, got home from the gym and I've been getting around. We're going on a boat with some friends today, but first I have a Poshmark show at 12. So I've been kind of like rounding everything up for that. I've got like 20 minutes until I need to get on that. And I've never even done like a live TikTok or a live Instagram like story or whatever it is, like a live Instagram. And it's basically like a live auction and people can like watch me live and choose what items they want and like me show them in real time. So kind of nervous for that and also my wi-fi sucks so bad in my apartment so i'm just like hoping everything cooperates with me but i have that and then i'm um, just going i'm kind of like getting everything around right now to kind of head out the door and go meet up with our friends i think it's only like 20 minutes away that we're going so we should be fine but um we're going directly after the poshmark thing so i'm making a smoothie right now i have had a little bit to eat after my workout making this and then gonna get on that so just wanted to update you guys i decided on this bikini i've been like going over the new bikinis that i got and deciding which one i wanted to wear today i love this color it's from monday swimwear and then this is an anine bang tee that i've had for so long i actually wore this um t-shirt on the day i moved into this apartment and i haven't worn it since i was like oh my gosh this like brings back memories to the day <laughs> to the day i moved in here uh it's funny what you remember about stuff that you wear and then i've got these same shorts that i had on yesterday which are a goldie so smoothie time the same one that i've shown you guys like 10 times oh my gosh guys i just did a poshmark live sale that was the most stressful thing i've ever done <laughs> That was like actually kind of scary. I felt a little overwhelmed, but it was actually, it went really well. I just thought that like four people was gonna, like I thought four people were gonna show up and 700 people showed up. So that was really crazy, but that went well. Now it's time to get ready to head out and 
here's the remnants of all of my Poshmark stuff and then packing my bag for the boat day. Coffee situation going down. I think this is my favorite coffee mug right now. It's just so cute. I think that they come in other colors, so maybe I'll see if they've got like a purple one and stuff. Because I like all neutrals, but a little pop of color for my coffee mugs makes for a fun morning. I sat there scrolling at photos on my phone while I was frothing and I got carried away with the froth. This is very frothy. It looks like I've got whipped cream on the top of my coffee. <laughs> All right, we've got our church outfit on this morning. I've got this button up, which is by the brand Inda, and I got it off Revolve. I got this quite some time ago, probably over a year ago, so I'm not sure. Wow, look at my hand. Okay, we're gonna fix that. I'm going strong with my coffee at home, y'all. Once again. Starbucks. Only one out here, she left me. Starbucks might be going out of business one of these days because of me. <laughs> so. Oh, this is perfect right here. Chips too? Chips. Do you want me to throw an ice pack on top of there? Jay has been telling me about this fish dip. This one's yellow fin for so long at a farmer's market from Orlando and then we just found them at the one in Tampa. And he's an excited so man. <laughs> Headed into Whole Foods to do my weekly grocery haul. Here's a little grocery haul. I just got back from Whole Foods. I got some asparagus, some broccoli, some mushrooms, carrots, chicken, ground turkey, cod, grapes. I got these sweet potato hash browns. I feel like these would be good in the air fryer. Some green beans, blueberries, Olipop, tomatoes, spinach, a little bit of spring mix, some olive oil spray, and some honey. I think that's everything. And some milk. Okay, updating y'all, way later. I think it's been a while. I did my grocery haul, and chilling with Jay right now. Hello, but <laughs> he's eating more. Earlier you guys saw him eat his fish dip, and now he's eating more fish dip, yeah, finishing yeah. off for breakfast and for dessert. <laughs> But I think I'm gonna end off this vlog right here. You wanna say bye to the vlog? Bye vlog, love y'all. Got too much dip Got on your tip. Got too much dip on your tip. It really is dripping all over the place. <laughs>